Welcome to AA Comics. I am Aaron Baldwin, and if this is your first time to the channel, welcome. If you're a regular at the channel, welcome back. I just want to encourage all of you to be part of some of the most tasteful creator content on YouTube. Hit the subscribe, hit the like, and be part of the fun. Now, this is a CGC unboxing for two graded books with remarks from Joelle Jones. And before I get into that, I just want to say one thing. Joelle, if you're watching this, you have an open invitation to come onto the channel anytime. I'd love to interview you, talk about how you got so good at your job. I think, you know, you're an amazing artist and I would just love to have that conversation open whenever you have time. I'm sure you're busy, but I'm just saying email, Instagram, you know, your people can talk to me. I don't, I don't really have people yet. I'm not at that, that stage in the game, but you know, I'm just, I'm putting it out there. So, uh, I've never sent in two books for remarks and to get graded. And I thought this would be a, a cool video to help those who maybe have never done it before. And those of you that have, you know, you can enjoy it because we all don't get remarks from the same artist. So thought it'd be a cool thing to share. So two ways, or if maybe three ways you normally get remarks, you reach out to the artist directly, uh, you go through a third party company, or you send them to CGC where they already have something set up. So I went through a third party company I went through Alpha Omega Certification Services. These guys were great, really professional. Uh, communication was fantastic. So I had some emails back and forth with them and I sent them two books. They took those two books. They sent them to Joelle. She did her thing. She sent them to CGC. They got graded. CGC sent them back to Alpha Omega Certifications. They checked them over, made sure they were good. And then they got sent from Alpha Omega to me. This whole process was about eight months, so if patience is not your thing, this is not for you. But I think it's really worth it. So I'm gonna show you the books in just a minute, but I wanna briefly break down who Joelle Jones is because some of you might not be familiar. Some of her more recent work was on Wonder Woman. Fantastic cover, uh, really phenomenal. She also has done work on things like Dark Horse, so Lady Killer is a big one. She did work on Supergirl. She was the writer and artist on Catwoman for a while. Uh, another big thing is, and I'm a big Batman guy, on Batman, starting with issue 33 of Rebirth, she was the first female artist to do interiors and covers for multiple issues, so it's a really big deal. Um, and I wanted to showcase a little bit of that art and how good I think her interiors are. If you check out uh, Jason and Duke here having a conversation, the expression in their faces is just incredible. Uh, in my opinion, you don't even really need the words. You can feel what they're thinking. Uh, at least I can. I think I think she does an incredible job. Her characters are just so expressive. Uh, her Catwoman and Batman quickly became among my favorites all time, which I think is maybe some of the highest praise I can give. I actually bought an issue 33 that she signed uh, awesome book, really amazing. And this is the issue that started her multiple interiors and covers. So kind of a historical book that I think flies under the radar a lot, but I think it's really cool. So I'm going to show you the remarks and then I'll do a financial breakdown at the end of this video if you guys are interested in that. So the first one, uh, was a Batman blank. It came back nine, eight. I unbox these for, uh, for time's sake. But, uh, so I asked for a desert Batman and a desert Catwoman, like them in the desert. So I sent, uh, this Batman blank and, uh, just look at that. The detail, I think it looks phenomenal. I'm, I'm thrilled with it. I mean, I'm glad it's a 9-8, but to be honest, this is just, I think it's fantastic. So there's that one. And then... She really, I mean, she nailed it on that one, but this one, I was, I was blown away. Um, so this is a Catwoman 80th anniversary blank cover. It also came back a 9-8, which I'm thrilled about, but look, look at that. Look at the detail. I mean, wow. So both, uh, both together just to sort of get them, uh, here, let me get them side by side for you guys. Really great, fantastic stuff. 
All right, so I'm gonna do a quick breakdown uh, of what it costs. So my overall total was $227 for both slabs. Uh, that includes uh, the signatures, the remarks, the grading fees, the shipping, the taxes. It was uh, 115 for the first one and 104 for the second one. The difference was shipping. It's $15 shipping for the first slab and $4 for each additional slab through this company. Uh, so yeah, like I said, comes out to 227. So you're looking at just over a hundred bucks a slab, about 113 range, which is pretty good. Uh, considering the, you know, the remarks are one of a kind and you get to get a remark from one of your favorite artists and Joel Jones is one of my favorite artists. I think it's worth it. But you guys can let me know in the comments down below, what do you think? Uh, what are artists that you would love to get a remark from? Uh, do you have a lot of remarks? Do you not have any remarks? So uh, I only have these and then I have uh, one from Joe Benitez that I got at a con that's not graded, but these are my first graded ones. So this was a cool experience. I'm glad I did it. If you guys have any questions or anything, feel free to put them down below. I'd love to have that interaction. I'm pretty responsive in the comments. So you guys have a great day. Stay safe and I'll see you later.